Durham Public Schools just announced earlier this evening that all schools will officially be closed tomorrow. DPS families have already dealt with a handful of closures recently due to tensions over the ongoing salary issue. WRL's Carly Haynes joins us live from Jordan High School in Durham with more. Carly. Yeah, Julian, buses won't be going in and out of this high school tomorrow. Parents tell me they often don't have a lot of time to prepare for these closures and because the board is scheduled to meet about the salary options next on February 22nd, parents don't know how many more of these closures there may be. Durham Public School families are gearing up for another day of no school. Ultimately, the students are losing out because one day is one thing, but it's just all these multiple days that are adding up. It'll be the fourth time schools have closed in half as many weeks. Now some parents, like Andrea Morelos, are worried about loss of valuable learning time. Ultimately, in the long run, I mean, you've got like the end of year testing, the EOGs. Um, I mean, I don't know how many days we're going to miss, but I mean, they, they start cracking down in these months to prepare for you for that. DPS says the reason for the closures is because too many transportation support staff called out. That includes people like mechanics who inspect buses and keep them running, not bus drivers. There are 45 transportation support workers and 150 buses in DPS. We want to see our kids and we want them to get the education that they need. Avery Thomas is a classified worker. She supports employees fight for clear and better pay, but says the impact of these closures could come back around. In the long run, if schools keep being closed like this, the school year may be extended because students have to be in school a set number of days. And DPS said 75% of their students take the bus to school. They're bus riders. So if these buses aren't running, those students can't come to school, Julian. Ah, so many people impacted by this. WRL's Carly Haynes live in Durham tonight. Thank you.